What is up? This is Rector. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Arkham Asylum. I'm the goddamn Batman. We're about to fucking yank some shit off some shit like Batman would. In the last episode, the Joker foolishly thought that um, a climbing puzzle would stop Batman. Which, I mean, seriously, Batman is not the kind of guy to be held Please back by climbing. Kid. You don't like, seriously. I don't have to. I don't have to. I just want oh, no, I want to know who's in there. <laughs> Who was in there? Okay, boss says no one gets past. Oh, we got enemies with guns now. You got it. Anyone coming this way? All right, so Oracle, Joker's men have taken control of the cell block transfer corridor. That's not good. I patched into a guard radio. It sounds like Joker's crew have got their hands on weapons. I know. I'll calibrate the cowl's vision mode to isolate armed henchmen. All right, cool. The direct approach is suicide. I need to be smart. Find a different way past them. All right. So, by the way, this is something. So is the bat really coming this way? I loved about this game. Um, he's a dead man. Tap. Drop down silently. Uh, move quietly by crouching. Oh, okay. This is something I loved about this game. Oh, whoops, crap. I fucked up, I didn't do silent takedown. I gotta do this all over again, because I'm so stupid. I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna die. One thing that I really loved about this game was that, um... Where'd he go? I don't know, I don't know! What am I trying to say? That I really loved about this game... Was that, um... Alright, then we gotta... Let's do it right this time. Trying to get him angry? Him. Oh crap, I fucked it up again! Alright. Oh, isn't that cute? Little bats are sleeping. Someone finish him off. Shut up! It's over back. Okay, so I'm gonna be honest with you. You can say that I'm not being true about this. But the real problem, the real reason I had trouble there, is because I figured that Silent Takedown would, um that silent takedown would be uh, the same button as normal takedown because if you're crouched what other takedown would you want to do other than a silent takedown like if you're sneaking up on somebody so yeah that was just a lack of me doing the computer controls right uh, I'm sorry for the mistake there it made me look like a fool but see I can do some silent takedowns like like the, with the rest of them I can silent takedown like everybody no else boss. the boys are just finishing off Arkham chumps never stood a chance. But good! Our friendly neighborhood rodent is on his way. You need to set a trap. He must not leave this building. Do you understand me? Yes, boy. as good as dead. I hope you keep your promises, boy. I'd hate to have to go and punish your family just to teach you a lesson. And I can promise you. They won't be laughing. <laughs> but Joker. Oh, look who oh, it yeah. is. Are your pointy ears burning? I suppose I'd better warn my boys you're on the way. Uh, hey, maybe I won't. It'll be a nice surprise. <laughs> oh, yeah, but one thing I really loved about this game was the way that um, guns hey, are approached. Hey, it's your friendly Uncle Jay. Some idiot is running around the asylum dressed like a bat. I know, crazy. Personally, I think the best solution is to put him out of his misery. It's the only reliable cure. Because, like, let's be realistic here. If you are approaching a guy with a gun, even if you're fucking Batman, you are gonna get your fucking ass handed to you. I mean, guns fucking... Actually, you know, <laughs> guns don't kill people. I kill people. No. But anyway, ser on, a, on a more serious note here, these, like, the fucking guns are going to kill Batman, even though he's wearing, like, some, you know, bulletproof armor and shit. You can shoot his face and stuff. I mean, so I always really appreciated. That was, like, one of my favorite parts of this game. Was that, um, if you get shot with a guy with a gun, it does a lot more damage than getting punched. And you can 
you can barely take any hits from guys with guns in this game. Like, straight up, it's it's suicide, just like Batman said, and that is, to me, completely I awesome. Love you, boys. Can I do a glide kill on this guy? Nope, I can't. Uh, oh, whatever. Fuck. That was a bad idea. I thought I was going to be able to... I was, but you can't glide straight down. That's you just really jumping. It was going to be that easy, Bats. I've set a few more of my boys your way. Let's see how you deal with these odds. <laughs> Joker wants him found. Spread out. He could be anywhere. Then keep your eyes open. Now move. Tell you the one about me and Batman fighting on top of the Gotham Library. <laughs> really, he's not that scary. He's nothing. Probably not even a man. <laughs> no, I'm a man. Alright, let's just do it. A... Oh crap. Alright, that was a mistake. Let's Dude, see I like areas like this because you can um you can really uh get around with these corners, like, you know, they have all the corners covered for you, which is pretty nice. And then you get corner cover in this game. Oh, let's get a little crouch action. Man, this combat is way fun, like, and my apologies if I stay in detective mode. Um, oh dude, that guy's gonna be able to see me from here. Don't worry, boys! You yep. Can do it. He doesn't stand a chance! Oh, crap. Alright, this guy, fuck it. <laughs> Doing it old school. And then we're just gonna fucking ground takedown. Oh crap, ground takedown, or oh, whatever. Fuck it, alright, F. This other guy's coming at me. Ugh. And then, and you know, they do let you, because you've seen in fights, you've seen Batman take some bullets and then get away, so they do kind of have it set up so you can, um... So you can, uh, if you swing between some... Some things for a couple seconds, it's easy to kind of, like, re-get your bearings, and let's get a silent drop down. And you can come back in after you, uh, they lose your scent, and you can come back and kill them, which, like I said, everything about the combat in this game, fucking awesome. It's super well designed. I think that's where Rocksteady really hit it really great in this game, was with, like, real Batman-esque combat. Oh, those were the easy ones. I'm just playing with you. You'll see. You'll see. Brr. Fucking Joker. Those were the easy ones. Yeah, right. They're all gonna be easy. Actually, that's not true. I already know, because I've played the second game, I know kind of, like, what the flavor of the enemies that are going to come, uh, that I'm gonna come up against are. And it's pretty crazy. Joker must have figured out how I was tracking Gordon. Officer Bull's trail stops here. Hmm. I wonder why Officer Bull's trail stops. Fucking... You're the worst officer ever, Officer Bowles. I hate you. Thanks for drinking on the job. Yes, it is I, Edward Nigma, the Riddler. And more importantly, your intellectual superior. My genius has allowed me to easily hack into your primitive communications. <laughs> My goal is simple. You complete a series of amusingly taxing challenges and, well, you'll see. Ready for your first one? Good. But be careful. Don't cut yourself on this sharply observed portrait. Alright, sorry about that. Yeah, Riddler's been yelling, yelling at me trying to get me to find this picture. I just couldn't see it for some reason. expected a child to work that one out, let alone the world's greatest detective. <laughs> Over here! What the fuck is that guy looking at? He's definitely not looking at me. He's just kind of like, looking up in the air like an asshole. Alright. Hey, buddy. Oh, I gotta talk to him. William North. It was a massacre. Bulls came walking in telling everyone to cover the front entrance. Said something about Joker's army coming through the main gate. Two of my guys moved to the exit, and Frank shot him dead. They never stood a chance. Was Bowles alone? Thought he was. Then I saw Harley Quinn. She was surrounded by Black Gate prisoners. 
They were just killing everyone in the room. I had no choice. I, I got in here, locked the door. I, I could see it on the security feed. They had someone with them. It looked like the commissioner. Bowles is dead. They carried on without him. Must have outlived his usefulness. Good. He was scum. Man, everyone in this game that becomes a villain are, always has, like, convenient names. I'm sorry, buddy. Like Edward Nigma and Harley Quinzel. They always have such convenient names to become the villains they are. It's just not fair. Alright, um... Oh, I guess this is an easy puzzle. Open the door. Puzzle solved. Let's see here. Oh, what did, the, what did that puzzle say? Oh, whatever. Fucking Riddler bullshit. Alright, well, with that, I am going to end this episode right here. Uh, this has been Rakdar. Thank you for watching.